All right, y'all, we're starting by putting two cans of apple pie filling in my limed crock pot, all right? We're gonna get out all the juice. We're making a simple, easy dessert. You kind of just dump everything in here and let it do its thing. And it's so good, y'all. Every time I make this, everyone eats it all up, all right? So there's a few different ways you can do this, but I'm gonna show y'all my favorite way today because I have a secret ingredient. All right, we have one can as well of jellied cranberry sauce on top of our apples, all right? So this is a good like fall, fall dessert. It's good for the holidays too, but I, I y'all, I love this jellied cranberry stuff. I, I just love it. I think it tastes so good. Like I could literally open up a can and just eat it by itself. Um, do y'all agree? I don't know. Even when I was a little girl, this was my favorite part about Thanksgiving, this jellied cranberry stuff. All right, y'all, so let's see. So on top of that, I have a couple tablespoons of cinnamon sugar. So we're just gonna put that right on top, all right? Right on top of our cranberries and our apples. Now I'm gonna give this a little mix just to kind of incorporate all that stuff, but that's great. All right, y'all, that looks so good. I'm so excited. All right, next, y'all, we gonna take, um, I have some uh, old-fashioned oats right here. We're gonna take about one cup and put it right on top. All right, right on top, just like that. That looks perfect. All right, next, y'all, I have a box of Watt cake mix. So we're gonna take this out. Oops, I almost spilled it everywhere. That would have been terrible. And we're gonna put this dry cake mix right on top of our oats, all right? So oat layer and then cake mix. And now, y'all, I'm gonna flatten this cake mix out a little bit. Oops, I'm being loud. I just used my spatula for the wet stuff, but we're gonna flatten this out a little bit, all right? So if y'all don't wanna use a crock pot liner, you don't have to. I got some new silicone ones, but I need to get like one big silicone one. I guess I didn't realize when I was ordering them, it's like two. I could put two in here at once, but we're trying to make one big dessert right now. All right, so we're gonna flatten that out, okay? On top of this, y'all, we're doing a little more cinnamon, just regular cinnamon, right on top of the cake mix. And then, last but not least, I have one and a half sticks of melted butter. So we're just gonna drizzle this right on top of our cake mix, all right? Right on top, one and a half sticks. Like so. So we have a nice butter layer on top. And that's it, y'all. We're gonna cover this. We're gonna cook this on high for like two to four hours. I'm gonna start checking it. Y'all know crock pots vary, okay? Sometimes I see a recipe online and it's like, cook it on low for five hours and mine's done in like three. So we gonna start checking it after two hours, but I'm so excited. Y'all are gonna love this easy crock pot cobbler. All right, y'all. So here we have that apple cranberry cobbler that we made in our crock pot. Y'all, this is making my whole, whole house smell so good. And uh, that's it. I'm excited to eat this. So remember, we used two cans of apple, one can of cranberry, some oats, yellow cake mix, and some butter, y'all. It's juicy. The cake is perfectly done. And the combo of apple and cranberry, y'all, is going to be so good. So yeah, I'm just going to scoop some of this out of here. Fred's going to love this. I already know. All right, y'all. So um, if y'all want to serve this with ice cream, you can. Instead of ice cream today, I'm gonna move this to the side. Leave my little bowl right here. I have some Cool Whip, Cool Whip. That's for my friend Misty. That's how we say it now, y'all. Every time y'all use it, say Cool Whip. It's so fun, right on top. All right, y'all, I'm gonna turn the camera around and we're gonna try this. I'm so excited. Y'all, here's my apple cranberry cobbler with Cool Whip. My hair is crazy today, but that's okay. I'm happy, I'm having a great day. Y'all, can y'all believe it's, I think it's September 2nd. I don't know when I'm posting this video, but right now, today it's September 2nd, and it's still 105 degrees in Las Vegas. Can y'all believe that? It's crazy, I'm so hot. That's it, so uh, yeah, good thing I made a hot dessert. <laughs> I don't think it's this hot everywhere, is it? Gosh, I don't know. All right, this is gonna be hot. hot. Y'all, okay. Oh my goodness. Mmm. Y'all. Okay, y'all. This might be um this might be my go-to dessert for fall this year because this is so good. The combo of the apple and cranberry. Y'all. Oh, I see a Kevin. I should go get Kevin. Come here, baby. 